What's going on, y'all? We are here with the Sour Patch Kids Tropical. Pretty sure this has already been around, but they say it's new. For the song of the day, I've probably heard this song at least 45 times today. But it gets a chuckle every time. And this is Mr. Mike Wood. Everybody knows Mr. Mike Wood. I am Chris. And so, have you ever tried uh, the tropical, like, Starburst and stuff like that? Yes. Yes, most As, definitely. What do you th do? You think it brings a funky taste or a good taste? Um, it's all right, man. I just can't do the consistency of Starburst, Nominators, things like that. All right. So this first damn dollar store. You at least give us enough that so I can find some. Great. This one is a passion fruit. They still look like a little kid. Chewy. Those are good Sour Patch Kids. That's, it came on strong. That's what I'm looking for when I get a sour candy, right there. Something good and strong. So I know you've had a medical candy before. Can you taste it when they come on? Like, can you taste the... In a good medical, man, you really won't taste any of the, any, any of the medication inside of there. So that means I've had a whole bunch of bad ones. Here's Mr. Orange. This is Tropical Twist. So how much of that school have they destroyed by your house? Or the playground? Um, I think they're about ready to start taking the building down. The playground's already Damn. pulled out. I wanted that bubble so bad. We can find that bubble on the streets. I know where it's at. If you can find it, bring it to us. Alright, so what would you say on the Tropical Twist? It had like a little orangey taste to it, but not... I like the tang, man. It does have a little tang. It's got a real good zing to it. Everybody loves them some pineapple. Ryan said he saw somebody throw a pineapple at the Warp Tour the other day. Yeah, I heard about How that, man. I heard somebody was like running back and forth in front of the pit, and then the pineapple went in the pit, and then Ryan and Slim were standing there and seen the top of the pineapple fly up in the air. That's a, a out of all fruits, I think that would be the worst one to get. You know that fuck up a shin, right? Yeah. Or a forehead. Blah. Where pineapple taste? It really tastes like if you're biting a pineapple, but but they add a lot of sour. I don't know if it's I don't know if it's on the the the, the sugary exterior, or whether it's actually inside the gummy. But these seem to be a lot more sour than a normal sour patch kid. Did we we didn't try the red, did we? No, not yet. So normal Sour Patch Kids are shit too? That's my favorite flavor of Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid? Yeah, red. Oh, well. Yeah. Yeah, I would definitely buy these. Three pieces in, I'm going to go ahead and give them a 7 out of 10. There are four pieces in. You want to try them? Twist. Unless there's a surfboard, man. Unless there's a surfboard. So you, th you say there's good? I would say the And they actually gave us every flavor. Yeah. I would say the Paradise Punch, only one I didn't like in the group. Ah, the Paradise Punch wasn't bad. The pineapple, you know, if I had to peak, pick a least, least favorite out of the four, the pineapple would be where I'd be at. I wonder how terrible these would be to make drunk gummy bears, because with all the sour stuff in them. Oh, man. You take a drink and you get I don't know if sours. you, like... Using just regular vodka? I'd use regular vodka on that. Like, but I bet it'd be decent. I don't know, just taking shots and having sour right now, I don't know if I'd be the Ralphie, but... I could do it all day long. So Mike Wood gives it a good, good approval. I give it a... No. Nah, I'll give it a, a 4 out of 10. 4 out of 10? Wow, you're a critic, bro. I'm just saying that last one... Or, well, not the last one. It's got... I'm not a tropical fan. So, Okay. Out of all these candy reviews that you've done so far, mm -hmm. what has been the most surprising that you've had? Oh, man, we had these ones that were kind of like this. Well, you had them uh, where you dropped the liquid. In yeah, it. yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought that was, it had like two tastes that were awesome. Like it didn't taste like they were combining tastes. It tasted like two tastes that you're like, whoa, this is good. And uh, let's see. And so what was the question again? What was it, what was the what was the best candy that you that the highest rated candy that you've tried so far? Because I know you're only trying new candies. No, I'm trying I'm trying even classic favorites. Oh, you're trying classic favorites too? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to say that one was the best so far. I really haven't. 
I, I'm more of, I like to see my, and then these ones don't, with my next statement, this don't go with it, but I like to see my girlfriend's face when I, in the summer, <laughs> when we give her nasty food or something like that, because just, okay. or seeing Ryan's face the other day, I haven't pulled nothing crazy on you, because you got to work them in easy, you can't be like, hey, I got this nasty shit, you want to go yeah, do I this mean, before work, you know. and be like, I made my tummy hurt. You're paying me, 20 bucks is 20 bucks, I'll leave a bone nuts bucks, sack if I have to. 20 bucks is 20 bucks these days. It's hard times in the streets. So tell us, are you having hard times in the streets? Um, Sour Patch Chris Kids. Chris does not actually pay for reviews. No. <laughs> um, tropical, I'm going to say Ant. Next time, I'm, now I know Mike Wood loves the, the originals, we're going to get the originals and maybe we'll blindfold them, see if he can be like, that's punch. Thugs, y'all have an awesome one. Have an awesome weekend. Remember, titties for life.